It's the NFL on EA Sports, and we are at Bill Stadium in upstate New York. A few moments ago... EA Sports coverage of the National Football League brings us to legendary Lambeau Field in Green Bay. No team means more to a city than the Packers to Green Bay. And this was the scene a few moments ago as the green and gold made their way out of the historic tunnel. They're ready to go as they get set to match up with the Buffalo Bills. Fields it in the middle of the end zone. And this will go as a touchback, and they will begin things at the 25. throw with Allen. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And they're able to get this one across the 35. 13 yards on the game's opening play. I like the screen being called here early in the game, especially on the opening drive, because Brandon, when guys come out of the locker room, especially those pass rushers, they are so amped up to get to the quarterback that you can use that against them, and a screen pass is a great way of doing it. A lot of teams against good pass rushing teams, they want to run the screen 10 to 12 times in a game. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. To throw, it's Allen. He's just going to dump this one off to his fullback out of the backfield. And he'll work it across midfield inside the 45. A good gain again. That's now 31 yards combined on those last two plays. So into Packer territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 44-yard line. So the shotgun snap to Allen. It's caught left side by John Brown. A gain of six there on first. Brandon, perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and it passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was complete. Four yards, the pickup, first down. Throwing now is Allen. Now they go screen, it's complete. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before he's dropped. 11 yards and a Buffalo first down. How about the start throwing the football? Four for four on this opening drive. Oh, he's slinging it. And oftentimes when you talk about slinging it, you're thinking about a guy throwing it all over the yard, not necessarily accurately. In this case, though, he's honing in on his targets, and he's delivering. Yeah, the opening script. However, they drew it up for this first drive, going to plan so far. Allen now on first down. Flush to his right, and he can't get rid of it. He's taken down. Dean Lowry in there to get him. It's a loss of five. 
Okay, was it a breakdown in protection? Did the running back not pick him up? What does it really matter? Sometimes it's just a great play made by the defense. Big time sack. To try again after the sack. Allen throwing right, and that's complete. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Touchdown. Cole Beasley, 27 yards. And the Bills take it all the way down the field and score on the opening drive. Well, that's how they envisioned it, get the football to start the game and score it. And I don't know if that was scripted. Tyler Bass was it an audible? Point. Or was it just a play call that they had in their pocket? No matter what, they had the right call on against the right defense, the and they end up in the good. end zone. No problem there on the extra point, and that makes the score 7 nothing. Tyler Bass to kick off for Buffalo. After the touchdown, Bass to kick it away. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Cost him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. First and 10 at their own 20-yard line. Rodgers will break the huddle and bring the pack up first and 10 at their own 20-yard line. Now the man from UTEP, this is Aaron Jones. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. Oliver made the Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. To throw, it's Rodgers. Oh, it was hit at the line of scrimmage and intercepted. Picked off at the 18, and he is going to score. It's a pick six and a Bills touchdown. Tyler. And this defense looking like they have come to play the pick six, and just like that, it's 13-0 early on. Well, go back with me to our training camp visits. What do we hear during these drills? Pass. Pass. Ball. Ball's in the air. And then my favorite, Oski. That's the interception. That means everybody finds someone to block, block them legally. Now, as this one's in the air. Three-yard line. About set to get this drive started. The Green Bay offense at the line. And fresh off the pick six. They've got to forget about that quickly. In this case now, the guy throwing the ball, he's got to be like what we talk about with defensive backs who get beat for a long touchdown. Short-term memory, right back out there doing the things that he does best and knowing that taking care of the ball is paramount. Here's his opportunity. <laughs> Comes back to those defensive backs for the formal D, former DB, right? I don't know where that comes from. It just kind of emerges out of me for some reason. It's deep in there, right? <laughs> 14-0 the score. This is the NFL on EA Sports. 14. Packers nothing. They had the catch on second down, but it didn't help at all. And now they're looking at third down here. Now a draw play. This is Jones. And they'll get him down about three yards short of the first. It's a gain of just three, and the offense likely going to yield to the punting unit here on fourth down. It's fourth down. They'll run it with Jones. And, boy, this is going to be close. That mark looks a little short, and he didn't get there. So certainly an interesting call there to go for it. And that will force a turnover on downs. They'll run on first down with Singletary. And he gets stopped up at the 31 after a gain of maybe a yard. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. A gain of a yard. Brings up second and nine. Allen. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he'll be a couple yards shy of the red zone here at the 22-yard line. For a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen pass. Looked like it was coming together. Looked like there was an opening. Still ended up with a solid game. They'll run on first down. 
Singletary. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. Devin Singletary. A solid pickup at 13 sets him up first and goal. We use the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? And they run here with Singletary. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. A nine-yard touchdown run. And the Bills will extend their lead. Offensive line coaches always tell their guys, if we score touchdowns, that means we get to the end zone first. That's exactly what those blockers did, clearing the way for their back. So five yards for running into. Lucky it wasn't 15 for roughing. No doubt about it because they protect the kickers and the guys holding the ball almost as much as they protect quarterbacks in the pocket. They don't want those types of injuries. And he'll get it up just past the 20 as his guys will go to work at the 21-yard line. The Rodgers will bring the pack up with a first and 10 at their own 21. That's thrown quickly out wide to Lazard. That catch good for only a couple. Ball at the 23, second and eight. A gain of two brings up second and eight. From the gun, it's Rodgers. And that is incomplete. The scoreboard tells the story for him a little bit bleak. And while it's not quite desperation time yet, it's definitely getting close. But the defense reads the scoreboard as well. They're going to back up and make him really earn it. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. Working from the gun, Rodgers. He's got Adams on the hookup. Rodgers finding Adams for a Packer first. Ball up to the 35 now as they come up on first and 10. Two minutes remaining in this first half for football. Throwing on first down is Rodgers. And that's going to be incomplete. Too tough to hold on to that one. It's second down. This team is not going to make it easy for you. They're a physical group, and we just saw it there on that play. They came in, made the contact, just as he's trying to haul it in. Adams hauling it in from Rodgers. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. It's a game of matchups, and that's why you take your receivers and move them around a bunch, especially your best guys. And when they work out of the slot, you often hear the coaches talk about how great it is because it gives you a two-way go. You can break out or you can break in. That makes it hard to defend. They stop him for only three that time, and that'll bring up fourth down. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. The conversion is successful with a sizable gain of 13, and the decision to go for it looks like a smart one. Throwing on first down, but this one winds up to be incomplete. Well, the incompletion, yes, but maybe here not the worst thing in the world? No, not on first and ten. Actually gives them a chance to regroup, relax just a little bit. They huddle up, talk it over. Then they get a chance to continue their drive. And he'll look for Adams again, and this time he's got it. The Packers going to use one of their timeouts as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. Ninth play coming up here on this drive. This is third and a yard. And he's going to be sacked. They sack him back right at the midfield stripe. Matt Malone.